Hello friends, hope you doing really great. Russia has recently offered the sale and joint production of Su-57 fighter jet to India. President Trump has also offered India the sale of its advanced fighter jet F-35. Now the question is which fighter jet should India buy? The two of the world's deadliest stealth fighters, one built for maneuverability, the other for pure stealth. In a real battle, which fighter jet would win? Speed versus stealth, agility versus technology, this is the ultimate battle of fifth generation fighters. In modern warfare, aerial superiority is a game changer and two fifth generation stealth fighters stand at the forefront. One is Sukhoi Su-57 Felon. And the second one is American Lockheed Martin's F-35 Lightning II. Both are cutting-edge aircrafts designed for dominance in the skies. But both aircrafts are designed for vastly different combat philosophies. So which one is truly the best? Let's break down their strength and weaknesses. First segment of comparison is design and purpose. Both jets belong to same generation of stealth fighters but their design philosophies differ significantly. The Sukhoi 57 is a multi-role air superiority fighter designed for high speed dogfighting, deep penetration strikes and advanced maneuverability. It emphasizes on agility, thrust vectoring and high speed engagement. The F-35 on the other hand is a multi-role stealth fighter built with a sensor-first, shoot-first philosophy. It prioritizes network-centric warfare, beyond visual range combat and stealth or close range dogfighting. So the key strengths and weaknesses for both the fighter jets are SU-57 has better aerodynamics, high speed maneuverability superior in dogfights. Although it's less stealth due to design choices and external weapons mounting. On the other hand, F-35 is best in class stealth, unmatched sensor fusion and advanced electronic warfare. But it is less agile and not built for close dog fighting. Also, it, it, it's slower than SU-57. Now let's compare in terms of stealth and survivability, the cornerstone of modern air warfare. Let's compare how Su-57 and F-35 handle radar evasion. The F-35 is designed from the ground up for stealth. It has much lower radar cross section than Su-57 thanks to its radar absorbent materials, serrated edges and internal weapon bays. It can evade most radars making it extremely difficult to detect. While SU-57 incorporates stealth features like radar absorbing coatings and internal weapons bay, it does not prioritize stealth as much. It has larger radar cross sections due to exposed engine fan blades, larger control surfaces and occasional external weapon carries. So F-35 is superior stealth better at avoiding enemy radars and engaging fast. But it has limited internal weapons capacity due to stealth configuration. On the other hand, Su-57 is stealthier than previous Russian jets but not a pure stealth design. In segment 3, we will be comparing speed, agility and super maneuverability. When it comes to raw speed and agility, Su-57 outclasses F-35. F-37 is powered by two AL-41F1 engines and can achieve a top speed of Mach 2. It also features thrust vectoring nozzles which allow it to perform extreme post-stall maneuvers like Cobra maneuver and Kulbit, making it one of the most agile fighters in the world. The F-35 in contrast has a single Petney and Vetney F-135 engine and reaches a top speed of Mach 1.6. It lacks thrust vectoring capability and is not designed for extreme dogfighting maneuvers. Instead, it relies on stealth and long range engagement to defeat enemies before they even see it. So, Su-57 is faster, more maneuverable and superior in dogfights. But 
it has higher fuel consumption higher risk in beyond visual range combat while f35 is designed for beyond visual range combat but it is not agile enough for close range aerial battles in segment 4 we will be discussing avionic sensors and electronic warfares of both jets in modern combat the ability to detect track and eliminate threats before they even see you is more valuable than raw speed and in this field f35 is a technological marvel it boasts the 81 sr radar distributed aperture systems and advanced sensor fusion the pilot's helmet allows for 360 degree vision effectively enabling the pilot to see through the aircraft warfare capabilities make it extremely difficult to lock into jam or trap on the other hand russia claims it had advanced electronic warfare capabilities but it is not yet battle proven so in this segment f35 is best in class avionics helmet mounted display unmatched electronic warfare but f35 relies heavily on software and data links vulnerable if electronic warfare systems fail su57 has powerful radar system but it is less effective sensor infusion than f35 now let's compare weapons and combat capabilities a fighter jet is only as powerful as its weapons the su57 carries a mix of long range and short range missiles including r77 r37 air to air missiles kh38 air to ground missiles and kinjal hypersonic missiles in future variants the f35 is optimized for stealthy strikes carrying aim 120 aim 9x side winders and precision guided bombs so su57 has larger variety of weapons and potential hypersonic capabilities weapons which reduces its stealth on the other hand f35 is optimized for precision strikes and internal stealth weapons so its a draw as su57 has more weapon options but f35 optimizes stealth deployment The next segment of comparison is operational use and global presence. The F-35 is operational in multiple countries with over 900 units delivered worldwide. It has proven itself in combat and is integrated into NATO forces. SU-57, however, has seen limited production with fewer than 30 units currently active in Russian Air Force. The full combat effectiveness of SU-57 remains largely untested. So which fighter jet is superior? One excels in speed and maneuverability, making it a strong air superiority fighter. However, the F-35 superior stealth, sensor fusion and operational success make it more dominant aircraft in modern warfare. If close combat is the main focus then SU57 would have an advantage. On the other hand F35 will be better if used to attack enemy positions. So depending on the choice if you want a defensive purpose then SU57 is better but for aggressive positions F35 is better option. India should purchase both of these fighter jets as combination of these would be deadly. What do you think? Let us know in the comment section. Hello friends, hope you doing 